Hi and welcome to my 2 minute tips for the best life. I'm Coach Marta. In this video, I'm talking about avoiders. Avoiders are those of us who sabotage ourselves by avoiding dealing with things. Often people with positive qualities like being easygoing and even keeled, positive and non-judgmental of others, when they overdo these qualities, they fall into avoider sabotage. You know that you have an avoider if this rings true. You procrastinate on unpleasant tasks. You say yes to things to avoid conflict. You downplay importance of problems or flat out deny them. You excessively put difficult things out of your mind. You engage in passive aggressive behavior in your relationships instead of directly naming the problems. You think that no good comes out of conflict. You think it's better not to burden other people with your feelings. You hope that problems might go away on their own. <laughs> Unfortunately, most of the time the problems don't go away on their own and could possibly fester and even get worse. Acting like there's no problem prevents us from actually solving them. Others might consider an avoider untrustworthy because of the long track of withholding unpleasant information. Problem resolution brings us closer and avoiding conflict keeps relationships very superficial. Avoider saboteur is especially sneaky because to see what we are avoiding to see is very challenging. Yet avoiders often suffer a lot. So here are some things for those of you who have an avoider saboteur that might help you get them under wraps. Number one, watch for numbness. Feeling numb for you is a signal to ask yourself, what am I ignoring? Number two, think of some situations where conflict brought something positive in your life. Appreciate your underlying strengths, such as even keel and easygoing, and use those strengths to deal with the conflicts. Notice if you're saying yes, but only because you want to avoid the unpleasant situation that comes from saying no. And don't say yes, practice saying no in those cases. Make a list of all the things you need to do and do any item that's on this list. Do not shame yourself for not doing the hardest task on the list. You can allow yourself to feel your negative emotions for a minute at a time instead of shutting them out completely. Ask someone in your life who you can trust to point out to you when you're avoiding stuff and thank them when they do point it out. Awareness is the very first step to change. By seeing that you habitually avoid stuff, you can actually change it. If you have an avoider and you would like to minimize your avoider's negative impact on your life, I invite you to join my six-week program running right now, Mental Fitness Positive Intelligence Program. And we work on all the saboteurs, so just check it out in the link below. I'll see you in the next video.